What is going on? We're back again, and today I'm going to talk about how um, I went to order my Hellcat Challenger and kind of the process of how what I did and how I got such a good deal on it. Um, so basically, what I did is I was looked and looked and looked for used cars on Auto Trader, Cars.com, Facebook. You could never find anything that was, oh, this is exactly what I want. Um, so what I did is actually went on the Dodge website and I'll go through this part as well. What I did is I went through, clicked my options that I wanted, everything that I wanted, and then with the Dodge discounts of the uh, power dollar discounts, I was able to get um, almost $7,200 off, I think. I think Dodge right now is giving you $10 for every horsepower that you, what your car comes with. So they give you $10 off. Long story short, I contacted a couple dealers and what ended up happening was I think my quote online on the Dodge website was $62,000 I believe. Um, and so what I did, I took a screenshot of it with all the options for my car and I sent it to a local dealership. Now, I actually sent it to a couple different ones. So one came back and said, oh, we could do that for $67,000. I was like, well, it's not going to work. And so I sent it to one here local in Chattanooga and what ended up happening was they sent me one back for $60,000 flat. And I was like, okay, so why is it cheaper? He goes, oh, we're going to give you different discounts or whatnot. I actually made it cheaper than the online thing was. So I said, okay, well, let's do this. So this is what I did. I went in, sent them everything, and let me show you how or I went through the process online and I'll go through that in just a second. So basically all I did was go to the Dodge website and then go over to the right and click build and price. And so once you get to this page you get to pick your model um, for what vehicle you want. Obviously click the Challenger and then scroll down to the um, trim package you want. So I did uh, Hellcat wide body. Um, didn't want a regular Hellcat, wanted the wide body package. And then obviously I spec'd out what I wanted, very basic stuff, just the orange color. And then I uh, chose the, I scrolled down and did the uh, orange brake calipers as well. Um, I thought that would look good with the orange paint. And then the only other option I got was the uh, red seat belts on the interior. It was just like a $300 I think option on that. But everything else was just stock. Um, the all the other packages I didn't want. I'm fine with cloth seats, no sunroof, no technology package, anything like that. And then obviously the standard transmission is the six speed manual. Um, that's what I wanted. That's why I wanted a regular Hellcat um, because it gave you that option. And then this is what I had done. So you can see these are the options that I um, I took screenshots of this and actually sent it to the dealership. And I was able to uh, show them what I wanted and compare the price for what I had online to what they could actually get it for me. And so I just, like I said, just did screenshots of this stuff. And then here's the breakdown of what I had as far as um, all the prices. You can see the $7,000 that I had off, almost $7,200 for the horsepower because this is a 717 horsepower car. And then these only two options that I got, and then it turned out to be 62000 I'm going to give you guys a little update on the delivery of the new Hellcat. So I just talked to the dealer this morning, and um, we just got back from vacation. But the dealer talked to the dealer this morning, trying to figure out. He told me that today he would know a delivery or a ship date. So I, I texted him. Texted me back a few minutes ago, and, and basically he said that by next Saturday, August 8th, is when the car will be shipped out from the factory. Now, if you know anything about Hellcats, they're assembled in Canada, so they'll be put on the car, car hauler in Canada next Saturday. And I'm assuming it's probably going to take about a week for it to get down here to uh, Tennessee and Georgia. So, hopefully by the end of... The second week of August, I'm shooting for the 14th or 15th, 
we will be taking delivery. I am so excited and I hope you are too. So again, we're gonna have, the car will ship out next week um, on Saturday and then hopefully be delivered the following week. So shooting for again the 14th, 15th of August and we'll make a whole video on that but I was going to go pick it up. Got a special surprise in store for going to pick it up and you'll have to see that when it happens but stay tuned for more updates i will keep you all updated i appreciate y'all watching my channel and if you have any questions let me know about the buying process or how easy it was um very easy process so again please like this video please subscribe and comment below and have a good day